In a prayer to the god Marduk from around the same time, we find this extraordinary combination of fierceness and mercy. This is on your handout too. Marduk, your stare is a serpent, a massive flood, an onslaught of the fire god, where is your equal? In your fury, you can be kind. Your mercy, Remu, like a father. Here we find the word Remu invoked as an aspect of Marduk's fatherhood and a counter image to the deity's destructive fury. What is significant about this reference is that it shows how this divine attribute, which was drawn from the life experience of women, came to be applied to a male deity and associated with the care of a father. In this way, it may offer a parallel to the way that feminine attributes for Yahweh, feminine attributes came to be attached to Yahweh in the Old Testament. This snapshot is instructive for how we think about the womb-like mercy becoming an attribute of Yahweh, a male deity. Just as the authors of these Babylonian prayers could imagine male deities like Marduk and Nabu embodying Remu, the biblical prophets Jeremiah and 2nd Isaiah could envision Yahweh offering Israel womb-like rachamim that a pregnant woman provides to her unborn child.